Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dorian. This is Ashley. Hello. Today we're gonna to talk about the five things every man should have in his bedroom. It's pretty damn important, I would say. I'm so excited about this one. <laughs> Especially when you're dating. More so when you're dating, I would say it's very important. But also, there is a level of kind of like self-respect and having a nice clean bedroom that actually makes you feel better. I've been on both sides of this as far as like, no, it doesn't matter. And then you've kind of won me over slowly over the years. And now I'm a bit of a clean freak about it. And oh, it yeah. does impact my mood and I don't know, just general well-being. Your bedroom should always be neat and clutter-free, at least as best as possible, yeah. because you know, there's that saying, messy bed, messy head. If you have a clean bedroom when you go in there, it's gonna make like all the stress from, from the last couple of hours from the day just instantly melt away and your bedroom is like your oasis. That should be your spot where you walk in and you feel immediately at ease. And so that's why it's super important to keep it clutter free and neat and have these items in there. Yep, let's get into it. There's nothing better than sleeping on clean sheets that's more comfortable um, when they're quality, they feel nicer and your guests, ladies, will absolutely, or men, or men yeah, exactly. <laughs> Everyone will notice and appreciate it because there's nothing more disgusting than going into a bedroom and it's just like, oh, when were these sheets last cleaned? If you have that question, now you're not thinking in the moment about like whatever else is gonna happen and now you're completely taken out of it. So it is important, so just do it. Yeah, any bleach spots, any <laughs> oh, yeah. stains, if oh. you are, if you cannot get that out or off of your get bed sheets, ones. you gotta get new ones. Yeah, please. Number two is a leather valet or a tray. I keep one of these on the nightstand or yep. the headboard, um, if it's a, like a larger headboard. And basically you keep your watch, your keys, I guess you can do that, or just kind of your little knickknacks, cufflinks, that kind of stuff you need. It just keeps things organized, they don't roll around everywhere, so it's just kind of loose and they get lost. It just shows, it's a mark of a more mature man. It's like these are the, the everything has a place basically. Yep. And I think that's critically important, this thing organized as well, and which again impacts your well-being. And women and men will notice this when they are in your room. The third one is a candle or reed diffuser. Basically some sort of scent or fragrance thing. But I think men, Ash, can maybe go a little overboard here where it's just like Cologne City all day. Oh yeah, that's so, not what we mean. However, yeah. I feel like this item is often overlooked yeah. and it's so important to have a pleasant smell in your bedroom because sometimes your bedroom can, it can smell a little get stale. Get a little funky. Get a little funky. So a great way to get rid of that smell and to actually have something that feels inviting um, is to have a candle or a reed diffuser and have it be like a light kind of airy, almost laundry-like smell, yeah. or even flowery. Definitely not something that's musky. Yeah, no, avoid uh, that, that. that. That's too too heavy. You wanna keep it really light, but have a candle, some kind of scent in the room. Women, men, anyone that goes into your bedroom will 100% notice and appreciate this aspect, this little detail that you put into to where you sleep. This is definitely something that women will respond to, no question. Bluetooth speaker or a little stereo, maybe with like a little Chromecast audio attached to it. Um, it can set the mood, it's good to listen to while you're in bed, like I like to read the, a book or a newspaper, put on a little bit of jazz, it's kind of creating like a nice comfortable environment, kind of cozy. Um, and when you're getting down with the ladies, you put on some of the slow jams. Make a couple playlists below. Yeah, no fellas. one wants a super quiet place. It's just a little bit it's of a, background music. It's a little weird. It helps just ease any kind of tension or any kind of nervousness. So it's always really nice when um, a little bit of music's playing. And so it's easy. A Bluetooth speaker does not take up very much room no. at all. And it's inexpensive. We've got our favorite ones, which we'll link in the description below. It's all about creating that little bit of ambiance. So oh, you got yeah. sight, sound, and smell, and yep. you're kind of covered. But there's one last one to get into. But before we get into that, Ash, what do they need to do? If you've been enjoying this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this, and hit that bell icon to be notified every time we upload a video. All right, do your drum roll. All right, so the number one item that you should- I would say the fifth one. 
Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> the fifth item you should absolutely have in your bedroom is. Da -da 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 -da. Your drum roll never ceases Whatever. to amaze me. <laughs> <laughs> I make it. Never, up. <laughs> never, never. It's never not good. Um, <laughs> this is a bit of a weird one, but it's been mentioned. Uh, Ash specifically mentioned oh, it, yes. and then we've we've confirmed this with a few of her girlfriends as well. Newer looking pillows. And I don't mean like throw pillows or accent pillows or anything like that. That's weird. I would never do that. Yeah. Women do that, not men. I but. felt so I felt like it was really important to put this item on the yeah. list because you would think like duh, of course, have like have newer like pillows. However, I cannot tell you how many times I've seen men at your clients' houses yeah, too. <laughs> but that have just like pancake pillows yeah. because they've had them for years and years and years and they're not gonna update them unless like their mom buys them a new yeah. set of pillows. As a man you don't really think about it because it's like, well it's comfortable and you're just kind of going about your day. But a woman definitely notices this stuff. Not sexy. So, yeah, it shows it shows a lack of forethought and a lack of just kind of overall decorum when you're having a lady in the bedroom, especially. So you want to make sure that you've got newer pillows that they're fluffy looking and they don't look like little flat pancakes. We'll link some of the best ones below. Big fan of the Tempur-Pedic or memory foam style ones ourselves, but there's some other good ones out there as well. Guys, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Make some magic in that bedroom. <laughs> <laughs>